Professional model Hunter McGrady made history as the curviest model to ever grace the pages of Sports Illustrated. But before she broke barriers in the beauty industry, Hunter experienced the ugly side of modeling. I'm Hunter McGrady, and you might know me as one of the curviest girls in Sports Illustrated magazine issue, the Body Diversity issue, but it wasn't always this way. I come from a long line of models. Ever since I was really young, I kind of did the whole posing thing. When I was 16 years old, I was very thin. I would exercise four hours a day, try not to eat much more than maybe a little salad, trying to fit these ideals. I remember booking a job, and when I walked in, they came up and said, you know, we have to ask you to leave because we didn't realize how big you were. I was a size two, and I'm 5'11". It was devastating. After that, I just took a step back from modeling altogether. As I was growing up, my hips were getting bigger. I was getting taller. And then about four years ago, Vogue Italia came out with an amazing cover. I saw the word plus size on it, and I thought, is this like a thing that's happening? Is a plus size, bigger, curvier girl something I could be a part of? So I went into Wilhelmina Models, and they signed me then and there, and I hit the ground running. It was just a constant stream of work. In October, my agent said, you book Sports Illustrated. We're working on flights to Anguilla right now. And I was just tears because I knew not only what this meant for my career, but what this meant for women everywhere. It's really a dream come true. Please welcome Hunter McGrady to the show. Now, Hunter, first things first, a lot of people don't realize those pictures in SI, you're actually naked. I'm naked. I have nothing but body paint on. Girl, I gotta ask you, body paint, naked, down there. How, 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 did, how did that go? There is no secrets in Mississippi. So, <laughs> like, you're, like, it's, you know, they're getting close to me. I'm bending over, they're painting my butt, like, the whole nine yards. Yeah, there it is. Um, and uh, every stroke is just painted on, and it took 12 hours. So, yeah, we started at 2 a.m. and ended at 2 p.m. Is it depressing when you have to wash off the beautiful swimsuit? It's very sad. I really contemplated possibly flying in it. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know how that would have been for my skin, but it would have been fabulous. What is the biggest message that you're sending with this? You know what? I knew that this was gonna be something big for my career, but more than anything, I knew that this was gonna be something big for women and men everywhere. Because they were gonna open Sports Illustrated, which is essentially the sexiest magazine that people wait for every year. Mm -hmm. And they were gonna be able to resonate with someone. And men were gonna be able to see someone that is a different size. I'm a size 16. Normally you don't see a 16 in Sports Illustrated, but, um, I was just excited to share that, and it, it, it made me feel connected with women, and I wanted them to open it and feel sexy and feel confident in their body, you know? Um, right. And that's, that's the kind of response that I've been getting, which has been so surreal.